you probably need the smaller one. <laughs> nice. Or whoever speaks English, whatever is in English. How to open the bonnet on a golf, on a shitty golf Mark V when your cable, or the bonnet cable is broken without altering the car at all. You have a little vent here, a little hole. Yeah. Just get your target. You're gonna see where the cable would go. You're gonna have to push right in the cable holder, I would say. As easy as that, obviously. You need the correct tool, a piece of metal that you find anywhere on the floor. And now I will show you guys where exactly I pushed over there to open this crap piece of metal made by Germans. Why do I remove this? Do I have to remove this? Do I have to do it or not? Maybe it, maybe not. No. Forget about it. Okay? This is a T27 Torx. Okay. You probably need a smaller one. <laughs> Twenty-five. It does exist at twenty-five. Uh huh. So forget about T twenty-seven, T twenty-five. Try not to pull all the bumper, leave it there. Ah, last time we didn't remove it, remember? Yeah. We just kept it, you can keep it as it is, but look, there are two more screws in here, so don't start pulling like I did. There's two more screws, you don't need to remove them anymore. Okay, so with the, this time you use the T27. These three bolts hold the actual latch of the bonnet, the mechanism. Just get them out. We actually work against Volkswagen here to show how crap their safety mechanism is and how easy you can open up a bonnet so then you pull this whatever and this is the piece where I pulled with that uh, special tool you've seen at the beginning of the video I just pull I just had to push here sorry didn't pull it I pushed it bang because the cable would go somewhere like this here yeah so this is where the cable was fitted whatever here and there something like that and then you place this back where it was, like that. So now, if you manage to open up your Volkswagen bonnet, please like and subscribe to my brother's channel. And thumbs up if you hate German cars, I do.